hello what's up guys how are you doing today good morning good afternoon and good evening depends on your location at this time of the day today is the fourth day in the month of june 2020 my time here is 5 52 in the morning that is nigerian time so uh, still talking about the edo state politics more revelation is coming out from different faction of the apc okay yesterday i gave you guys an update that um, the news that is uh, peddling around the social media how obaseke uh nominated sorry purchase a pdp uh nomination form because he was not sure if he will win the primaries of uh, the next governorship election in a do state so I gave you guys uh, the update that um, Obaseke had returned his nomination form to APC Secretariat. So after the submission of his form, um, he had to make some revelation. And according to him, he said um, he has helped, he has revealed how he helped Oshomole to become a do state governor that was back then okay so um, i'm gonna give you details of this story but before then don't forget to subscribe and also turn on the bell notification so you get instant updates whenever we have issues like this to share with you guys just like i promised that i will be giving you all the necessary updates on this edo state election okay so let me go straight down to uh, the details of this his revelation so the governor of Edo state godwin obaseke said he um, has helped his predecessor that is adams oshumule when he had no money during the time he contested to become the governor in 2007. oshumule who was a former president of the nigeria labor congress nlc contested under the action congress and lost to the pdp candidate okay but however he challenged the outcome of the election in court and was declared winner one year later obaseke while speaking with journalists after submitting his nomination and expression of interest form for the 2020 governorship election in abuja also insisted that he did not betray Oshumule, okay, who is now the national chairman of All Progressive Congress, APC. According to him, in quote, he said, In life, everybody gets help. Everybody gets assisted. The person you talk about, that is Adams Oshumule, he had no money when he left labor to contest. We knew what we did to make him governor. I sacrificed eight years of my life pro bono. I collected to no Kubo to serve him in Edo. So when you talk of betrayal, the biggest betrayal can be when people betray a cause, when they betray an idea. I want to put it on record that I am grateful. He insisted me, he assisted me just as I assisted him. I know the sacrifices we make to make him national chairman. So that was the revelation of Obaseke. Well, in game of politics, um, this is how it is. Okay. No wonder for me, Obaseke still insists. Okay, that whatever he is not afraid of Oshumole. So maybe there is hidden agenda between these people. Okay. But nevertheless, don't be surprised. It is all a game of politics. Let me tell you something, guys. Don't be surprised that between Obaseke and Oshomole, we may believe or we may uh, be made to believe that there is a serious issue going on between those two. Don't be surprised as well before the election these two guys will have to settle their differences don't be surprised that oshumule and obaseke may work this may cook this up 
just to make sure they confuse the masses or they confuse the people of Edo State, making them to believe they are two people apart. Now, let me tell you a story. I was witness an incident like this. Different party, different faction had to meet the people in a particular location in that community fought between themselves just for political interest all right but the same day they had violent the same day the youth the community had violent fighting for these guys that same night was the night i saw these two politicians together drinking and whining together so during that period i now understand that this game of politics or politics is just a game just like the way people insinuate all right these are the two men the youth fighting on their behalf youth fighting themselves because of these guys those were the same people who were dining and drinking together now let us look at the same incident in the um, Ekiti state now during a uh, fire she and fire me ten or period before this election we all remember what happened after sometimes when fire me won the election the governorship election in Edo state remember we all remember that fire me attended fire she son i think son or daughter's wedding those were the two men at the Ekiti State youth were fighting for. Those were the two men Ekiti youth were killing themselves for because of election. And they are the two men today, okay, whining and dining together. What message are they giving you? It also happened um, in, I believe, in Akwa Ibom. When God will Akwa you and um, is it Nsima Ekere? those were the two men that do not want to see theirself okay making the youth to believe that these guys they are enemies among themselves but what happened later on these were the two men dining and whining together now what is the message and what message are they sending to the youth out there who fought on their behalf all right so like i said it may be a game plan between obaseke and oshomole it can happen maybe we don't know making us to believe making a, a doste to believe that these guys are working on their interest or the faction to believe these guys are working on their interest but no like i said don't be surprised that oshomole and obaseke will settle their differences before this election. Now that Obaseke had made a revelation on how he helped Oshomole to become a do state governor during 2007, okay, that he helped him out. So don't be surprised something on the ground is going on when it has to come with politics. I really don't, you know, put my mind inside nigerian politics to be frank all right so let me know what you guys think on the comment section below obaseke said that he has what he once helped oshumule to become the governor of edo state back then in 2007 so what is going on today what is happening today we are yet to understand these people's game plan it is all a game plan let us not be caught up by all this story of Oshumule's faction and Obaseke's faction. For me, I may believe it may not be far from the truth. I may believe it is all a game plan. Let me know what you guys think on the comment section below. See you guys in another video.